On a weekly basis, you may want to dust all hard-to-reach corners and high areas, as well as pressure wash the stairwell for a more thorough cleaning. There are four simple steps. First, dust the hard-to-reach places. Next, spray the stairs with the proper amounts of cleaning solution, allowing it to penetrate and float the soils. Then, blast and rinse the soils. Finally, vacuum the dirt away. Place the kayak at the bottom of the stairs so it is out of the way while cleaning and is in a position to catch any water. Set up the machine for dry vacuuming. Unscrew the wand locking collar, remove the vacuum head, and attach the dusting brush. High dust all hard to reach areas, and then dust the corners of the stairs. Detach the pressure hose from the wet-dry converter and reattach the spray gun. Choose the proper chemicals and check the label for the correct dilution ratio. Select the appropriate metering tip and place the cap back on the bottle. Turn the switch to select your chemicals. Turn on the vac motor. Attach the gulper tool to the vac hose and place it at the bottom of the stairs. This will pick up excess water that may pool at the bottom of the stairs. Turn on the pump. Unwind enough of the pressure hose to reach the upper area of the stairs and continue to lay out the hose behind you. Pull out the spray nozzle to set it for low pressure and rotate it to the right for fan spray. Spray water for about 10 seconds to give the chemicals time to feed through the spray line. An alternate method is to turn on the vac motor and spray directly into the vacuum hose for about 10 seconds. In some cases, this may be preferable to spraying excess liquid onto the floor. Next, cover the steps with chemicals using a side-to-side -side motion starting from the top and proceeding to the bottom. Turn off the chemicals and continue to spray water through the line for 10 seconds to purge it of any remaining product. At this time, you may want to scrub the stairs with the optional Kai brush for optimal cleaning. Push in the spray nozzle to set it for high pressure and rotate to the left for a pinpoint stream. Then, wash out the rest of the chemicals still in the line. Pressure wash the stairs from the top down. Always spray downward towards the lower step to avoid getting wet. Blast the corners and crevices, loosening soils and washing them down the steps ahead of you. Rinse and clean any smudges or stains on non-porous walls and handrails. Turn the pump off. Lock the safety on the gun. Grab a Kai towel and using the right hand rule, wrap the pressure hose while drying it off at the same time. Turn off the vac motor and remove the gulper tool. Fasten the wet back squeegee head which contains two small rubber strips onto the wand. Attach the wand to the vac hose. Turn on the vac motor. Clean the area directly around the Kayvac machine. Having done that, you can now unwrap the necessary length of vac hose, resting it in a neat bundle without laying it in the soiled water. Vacuum each step completely, starting from the bottom up using the plunge and swipe method. On your way back down the steps, touch up any remaining water spots. When you finish vacuuming, return to the no-touch cleaning machine. With the vacuum motor still running, turn the wand upside down and tap it to dislodge any remaining liquid and to prevent dripping when it's unhooked from the vac hose. Unhook the wand and set it aside. Wrap up the vac hose, making sure to leave the vac motor on. This keeps liquid from dripping out of the hose as you wrap it around the posts. Turn off the vac motor. Place the base of the wand in the convenient drip tray and snap the top into place. Unplug the GFCI and wrap up the electrical cord. Use the Kai towel and the right hand rule to wipe it off. Take the machine to the next cleaning area or storage closet. For more information on cleaning other areas of your building or to schedule a demonstration, please give us a call at 1-800-287-1136. Kaivac. All surface, all building, every day.